Hello everyone. So in the previous video lecture, we have discussed torsion function. And in this video lecture, we are here with a question on the application of that function. So the question is find the number of subgroups of a cyclic group having order factorial 10. So to find the number of subgroups of this cyclic group having fact, uh, number of elements uh, factorial 10, we need one thing. What is that? We have to find the, the factors, the prime factors of factorial 10. Means how can we write factorial 10 as the product of prime or power of primes? All right, so first of all, uh, what is the way to write factorial 10 as the product of power of primes? So the way is, the first step is to write this factorial 10 as the product of primes. So what are the prime numbers less than 10? Prime numbers less than 10 are what? Two. 3, 5 and 7. So we need to write this factorial 10 as some power of 2 into some power of 3 into some power of 5 into some power of 7. Alright? What is the way to write? The way is what? Please watch carefully here at this moment. So first of all, divide this 10 by 2. What will you get? 5. Again, divide this 10 by 2 to the power 2. So divide this 10 by 4. 4 to the 8. Okay, you are getting 2, then point, and 0, 4, 5, sir, 20. Okay, but ignore this. This is important. Ignore. Okay, and we will do this ignore many times. Okay, so we, we are not interested with what else is coming after this decimal. So we are interested with 2 only. Ignore this again. 10 divided by 2 to the power 3. So 10 divided by 2 to the power 3 means what? 8 divided by 10. 8 1 ja 8. 2. And there is something here. So we will ignore whatever is here. 1. And 10 divided by 2 to the power 4 is certainly, <laughs> we can say, 0. We, okay. So this is the way. So now what is your A? Your A is the sum of all these. 5 to 7 plus 1. This is your A which is 8. Sum all these things. This is the way to get. Now divide this 10 by 3. So 3 3 is a 9. Okay. And then this way you have to ignore the things after decimal. 10 divided by 3 chi square which is certainly 1. And 10 divided by 3 ka power 3. We are not interested with anything. So here what is your B certainly? Four. All right. Now, uh, ten divided by five to the power one. Certainly, you will get two. Ten divided by five chi square, which will give you zero. So certainly, this c is what two. And the last one is what ten divided by seven. Then we shall get what one and 10 divided by 7 chi square, which is 0. So certainly D is what? 1 plus 0 is 1. So this is our A, B, C, and D. All right. So now from here, factorial 10 can be written as what? 2 to the power 8 into 3 to the power 4 into 5 to the power 2 into 7 to the power 1. Is this clear? Now we have to find the number of subgroups. So the number of subgroups is what? Certainly tau of factorial 10. Please go to my previous lecture. 
and what is this this is nothing but a plus 1 a is it 8 plus 1 into b plus 1 into c plus 1 into d plus 1 and certainly after calculating you will get what 270 please do multiply and check verify okay so this was the way to find the number of subgroups of a cyclic group no matter how bigger their order is but it should be finite okay so this was the way to find the number of subgroups please do subscribe my channel to enjoy this kind of problems and you can also send your own problems you will certainly get the solution till then okay bye bye Take care.